Welcome back. I've been waiting for the answer to this freaking question for 24 hours. <coughs> what, was the, what was the question again? You know, you remember the... It's no. sitting here, growing my beard out. Anyway. Uh, yeah, so there's Metroids in uh, the Kid Icarus games. But they're not called Metroids. They're called, like, something with a P. Polaroids? I don't know. Some shit like that. But yeah, they're, uh... I think that was because they were in development at the same time. I don't know if it was the same team or not. We have to kill Godzilla. That's great. Who, uh... How do I put this? Uh, I can't really take Kraid seriously. Because the uh, fact that all it does is scream and you fill it with lead? No, it's, there's a Star Bomb music video. It's just great. It's, oh. it's really stupid. Bastard? I, I, I don't know. It kind of makes Kraid out to be a pervert. It's pretty funny. I didn't think Kraid even had a personality. He does it. I know it has a, some star bomb being weird. <laughs> so I know it has some semblance of intelligence. I said Ridley is intelligent, but he never speaks. But he, well, that's not true. He fucking screeches at you. Screeching is not a sign of intelligence. <laughs> that's more of like I'm screeching to... is a sign of intelligence. You argue with a guy and he's not Every time I waiting. screech at a woman, automatically they think I'm intelligent, or they run away. <laughs> I mean, if you're it's, arguing it's, with it's some dude, that or the other. <laughs> if you're arguing about a dude about some like, let's say Marvel or something, and he's he's not agreeing with you, he's just screeching. He is not in an intelligent state of mind. <laughs> he is he simply just not. <laughs> but honestly, uh, no, I think maybe you're kind of wrong. Cause okay, think of it this way: dolphins are intelligent, correct? Yeah. They don't fucking talk. They just go. It's not whatever the fuck dolphins do. It's not a screech, it's just a... Well, that's how, that's how he talks. That's his language. You're hating on Ridley's culture. We don't ever see another Ridley aside from that clone That's because he killed him. Because he was intelligent enough to end his whole race. <laughs> I'm intelligent enough to the suffering of life. He is There's famous. nothing but reproduction and death. That's what every alien civilization should know. If you have a baby and it's purple, it's going to kill every last one of you. <laughs> what if they're just naturally purple? I don't know, man. Like, you ever read the Marvel comics? Like, I think Thanos and, like, Star Fox are related, but, like, Star Fox is like a normal dude, and Thanos is his purple giant thing. Star Fox, like, uh, the comic character of these Star Fox from the. No, the comic. No, yes, Star Fox from the Star Fox 64 games is That's what I'm the thinking. brother of Thanos. Thanos no. has a brother? I'm yeah. wondering a lot of things here. Well, he's a brother or his cousin or something, but yeah, he's one of them. He's one of the people from Titan or whatever. Titan? Uh, like, the, like the moon of Saturn? I think that's where they're from, yeah. That's a different where he's called the Titan. Whatever, that's not the point. The point is, is that intelligent and purple equals genocide. Shun Tzu, the art of war. They should just put that in the book. Yep. You should go buy the book and just sharpie scribble it. Scribble that in the back. Yeah. We have a big old sharpie. It's the most important part. It's the only thing you need to know. Just just look at that, put it back on the shelf, and never touch the book again. Right next to the other art of war. If you can, like, predict basketball moves, then you are, like, absolute. To study the dunk. I, I, actually, dunk I don't even know if I should say that. Uh, skip ahead, like, three minutes, anyone watching, if you haven't seen and want to watch uh, Kuroku's high school basketball. The reason I'm saying that is because, bro, this, uh, the final, like, bad guy in that anime, that had me dying, because I'm just like, Ugh. I was walking in my friend's room when he was watching it, and he's like, oh man, it's this anime about basketball. I'm like, well, I like basketball, and I like anime. So I decided to watch it with him. And this guy was just like, goes from just playing basketball to just becoming God. He's like, I am absolute. And just fucking just just like draws. super Like superpowers or something? No, it was like this this evil face. And he was just like, God. <laughs> and they're like, how is he doing this? And I'm like, God damn, dude, this basketball for calm yourself. Do they go any, they do any weird stunts? Yeah, or? they like, 
it's almost like they have basketball centric super it's super weird man like but it's like that special kind of weird that's awesome to watch like there's this one guy who's like he can copy anyone's move is like his power what the hell i don't know it's this is basketball it's really great though i actually would recommend it like it's pleasantly just fun and weird Yeah, I don't think that's gonna work. It would if I had the patience. Why are all these things in a tube? They're in there to die. <laughs> Aren't we all? I don't know. That kind of seems weird to, to have your whole existence just being a tube bumping back and forth. Well, yeah, but I'm just saying, like those things are loose everywhere else. Why are those that one particular group of them trapped in a tube? I think it's for a gameplay design to show that your that boost ball can kill them. I mean, they're not, they're not wrong, but... I mean, for them, it's just pure suffering. They gotta be smacked dead like 100 miles an hour by a small ball. Nope. Oh. Right into the acid pits with you. Or is that supposed to be lava? No, that's acid. There's a acid and magma in each one. And once you get to the various suit, you're immune to acid. Hmm. Dang it. You think these uh, Chozos would just give you the all-powerful suit instead of ha forcing you to collect every piece of it each time? You have to prove yourself every By time. Dying. What happens is just Samus just get on the ship and all of a sudden your suit's like deactivating. Cool shit. You know. I think most of the Prime ones explain why you lose everything, but the main games don't. Yeah, I mean, like... Except I, for fusion, obviously. I can get having to collect everything like Legend of Zelda. It's because, like, you're a different Link each time. But it's like the same Samus had to collect the same powers. Dang, this is a lot of paths I can't go to. What is down? Is that for you? This game has some great music for the GBA, though. Oh, that's great. You ever listen to the title screen just leave it on as... It's actually kind of sad. Oh, what? Uh, what? Yeah. Uh, okay, when you say that, are you saying like the music is melancholy? I yeah. think that's what you're trying to say. You just made it sound like you just leave this house ground and just think about it. And it's like, that's kind of sad. <laughs> I got yeah, it's more like a melancholy way. Crate map data acquired. So the whole area is just named after him? He has a big ego. Ridley's like, I mean, Ridley. does he? It's his fucking part of the planet. He's a deeper part of Or maybe he's like, or maybe it's not that like it's named oh. after him. Maybe he's named after it. Nah. Sure. Nah, okay, they took over this planet. This is Samus' old home planet. Kind of weird if he just existed here. Oh, so he just named it after himself. I would like to say that's stupid, but I've seen plenty of people who like buy property and they name the road like their road. Really? Yeah. Not that. No. I'm Got, this is, I was gonna say, is that that shocking to you? I mean, heck, I think our cousin actually did that. Well, I think if you're the only house, you can just easily. Do. Hmm. Where do you go? Where the hell do I go? Uh, you're telling me, man. I'm trying to remember. get up there. This is only the only really troubling part of the game for me. Everything else is just streamlined. Just crate? Yeah. When I first played the game, I was stuck here for hours. I thought I didn't know about the breaking walls as easily. Same thing with Fusion. I got stuck in Area 3 for quite a long time. I know, just shoot everything and use a bomb on everything and you'll find the answer. Well, isn't that the way everything is? Uh, Can you grip on that? I had to freeze him and leave him the platform. Now we wait. So you enjoying the weather? No. It's it's been raining for the last two weeks straight. Because of that, everything is bad. 
But everything is bad. It's just been flooding everywhere. Wow, you are screwed. Wow, that's... That actually happened. Oh, I saved and created, right? Yes. Thank you, Lord. Hey, you could just reverse time. Well, I reversed it somewhat. I just... All those areas have... I have just Prince of Purs of this shit. Yeah, I could. The power of the SNES Classic. Wait, and don't let me do it on a, on a uh, GBA game for some reason. Okay, so never mind. My punishment taking the easy way out. It's fine. I didn't lose much progress. Oh, I'm an idiot. Yeah, we were just commenting about this jar, actually. Yeah. Yeah, I can just uh, skip the entire middle of that video. No. Well, you have still... to watch it. They've already watched it. This is the point in the video you're allowed to be at if you wanted to watch Kuroku's High School Basketball. If you didn't, oh, you have cool. to watch the rest of that. That's just... That's just the way things are. You have to suffer for watching something. I don't make something. the rules. Oop, oop. Okay, maybe I do make the rules. Make the rules. But I also enforce them. I can turn and this thing off. Mario right pipes now. are horrifying on this world. Hey, imagine if that popped out when you going on the pipe. Yeah, you're just like playing Mario. Like, Woohoo! Woo <laughs> fucking monstrosities just bust out of pipes. Not the normal ones you're used to. Uh, okay, I thought you were just doing that for like. No, nope, that's a requirement. Really? Yeah. Turn the power on. Good job. I get health I really could have used a while ago. Oh. Oh, cool, save point. Scorpions. Is that what those things are? Yes, it's a save point. I thought about those things that were following you. That looks like some kind of fly monster. Do you like a lot of the enemies in Metroid have like names? Like a lot of the Mario and Donkey Kong enemies, or are they just like generic thing B? Um. Well, I, I think they have stuff these in the generic, but yeah. <laughs> so they have stuff in the manual. Might be a worm. Ugly. Oh, that's a worm. Oop. I'm kind of weird if it was. They actually have things that look like that in the ocean. They're real. They're not that big, though, thank God. I don't know. I don't really have a super big fear of the ocean. I don't, but I don't want to. I wouldn't want to go down there for long periods of time with these things. Well, I mean, you couldn't go down there for long periods of time, so you count yourself lucky. Heck, have you seen a, a female angler fish? Those things are terrifying, Logan. Doesn't the pressure from going down there like kill you or something? Yeah, I think you gotta get yourself used to it. I mean, if you're a submarine, you can see it. I if you're know. a submarine, and one day I'll be a submarine, just to make you proud. Are you proud, Daddy? Don't, don't fucking say that like that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's no bottom. It's just the, there's yeah, no yeah it's just acid. I thought there was a, no bottom tide. I can go down there. Nope. Straight into the acid pits. So much just go through that without even flinching. Besides the obviously pain, or you think she's well, screaming on the inside? Yeah, I, I don't know. Kind of hard to tell when she's wearing a suit. I imagine without the suit, her whole leg would dissolve instantly. Well, no. Isn't there a part in either this game or a different one where you are a zero suit Samus? Yeah, but Samus. Yeah, but there's no uh, magma or acid in that whole section. I think there is, but you can't access it. It's just before the uh, you get the gravity gravity suit and it becomes pointless. Well, if it's anything like Super Smash Brothers, obviously zero suit Samus will be superior to Samus in every way. I think that's all ultimate, right? 
it's the same thing in Ultima. I know in Brawl she wasn't. No, but like, in uh, Super Smash Bros. Wii U and DS and Ultimate, yeah, Zero Suit Samus is arguably better than Samus. For now, at least. Which is weird, because I think a lot of people use Dark Samus, though. There's really no difference aside from a few poses. No, I think there's actually like a difference in like the way the attacks are. No, it's an Echo Fighter. I don't know. Well, yeah, but Roy's an Echo Fighter of Mark, but they have a slight difference in like their attack. Oh, really? Yeah, you do all that. But Roy was made before the Echo Fighters was a thing. But yeah, he does that little uh, neutral B that just uh, hurts him if he charges. Explodes. Him. Yeah. Plus, his damage does more towards the hilt. We. I cannot hold. So, how far are you in the progress of this game? Uh, you only had to really beat Ridley, Crate, and Mother Brain, and Mecha Ridley. You oh. haven't even beaten uh, Crate. It's only near the end of the second episode. I'm already close to Crate, so you should be doing good. Now I don't need to kill him. Do I? I don't think you have to. I have to kill him. You have to kill both of them? It's gray, you gotta kill everything. Well, the more you know. Oh, wait, I have missiles. Them. That's right. Until you run out of missiles from using them. Don't you need them to beat Kraid? He shoots spikes and they give you stuff. The bosses don't let you run out of things that you need to kill them with. That's convenient. That's some good gameplay, I guess. Oh, that happened again. I am I am rusty. Hmm. I wish your name was Crimson. Nah. What? We'll try again in a little bit. Yeah. Next time, uh, we can want you to die to something bigger.